Hi, my name is Ken Fleischman. I'm a professor in the School of Information at the University of Texas at Austin, the UT Austin iSchool. And I'm here to present today about our uh, PUN uh, second network challenge uh, grant, uh, the PUN Social Justice Informatics Faculty Fellows Program. It's a collaboration between the UT Austin School of Information, uh, Houston Tolson University, the City of Austin, Capacity Catalyst, and Measure. So the Pitt UN Social Justice Informatics Faculty Fellows Program uh, builds from our first network challenge project, um, Informatics Education 2020, um, the uh, Public Interest Technology University Network Conference on Undergraduate Informatics Education. Um, and we held this event right before the start of the pandemic on March 3rd and 4th, 2020. So at the time we didn't realize how fortunate we were to be able to pull off an in-person event right before that uh, became uh, pretty impractical for, uh, for quite a while, unfortunately. And um, we were able to bring together representatives from 30 different universities across the country, as well as from uh, local governments, uh, nonprofits, and even industry. And so it's great to have um, so many faculty from so many different universities, many of them uh, Pitt UN members, many of them hopefully future Pitt UN members. In particular, we had some fabulous presentations uh, from our colleagues at Houston Tillotson University, uh, which is a small liberal arts uh, university here in the city of Austin. It's also the oldest university in the city of Austin, and it's also a HBCU. Um, and so um, Amanda, Amanda Messino at Houston Tillotson uh, was uh, collaborating with uh, Paulette Blanc from Measure and Sarah Mohammed from Capacity Catalyst. So uh, did a really uh, excellent work uh, presentation workshop at the conference. And also um, the city of Austin also did excellent workshop. So we decided let's do a um, citywide community of practice connecting local government nonprofits and uh, our respective universities. So the goals of the Pitt UN Social Justice Informatics Faculty Fellows Program were to develop the field of social justice informatics. Um, we are now offering in the UT Austin I School a BSI and BA in informatics, including a concentration in social justice informatics. And we feel that social justice informatics is a growing area of research globally. So, so uh, informatics is the application of information and technology to solve problems, um, such as health informatics, for example trying to make uh, contributions in terms of the nation's health and well-being. Um, in this case, with social justice informatics, we're trying to fight inequities and injustices in society and come up with uh, more just and sustainable solutions uh, using information and technology. So our goal was to develop a community-wide, uh, citywide community of practice to connect Houston Tillotson, University of Texas at Austin, the city of Austin, and local nonprofits. So to recruit, we did a broad distribution across Houston Tillotson and University of Texas at Austin, as well as uh, the city of Austin and nonprofits, including uh, holding multiple recruitment workshops. Um, we asked applicants to please describe what social justice informatics means to you and the role that you want to play in leveraging information technology to achieving social justice. So our great team of organizers, we had uh, organizers from the UT Austin I School, um, such as Amelia Acker, uh, Jackie Bailey, Elliot Hauser, uh, Min King Lee, Eric Meyer, Lorreen Roy, Natasha Saldana, and Jeffrey Willette. Um, from nonprofits, from Measure, uh, Paulette Blanc, and um, from Capacity Catalyst, Sarah Mohammed. Um, from the city of Austin, uh, Ted Lair, Charles Perma, and Sarah Smith. And I would say most importantly, from Houston Tilts and Amanda Messino. Um, who is really a driving force, especially in the, the summer projects that we've undertaken and just a wonderful collaborator to get to work with. And um, so uh, based on our organizing team, we recruited a uh, cohort of fellows um, from six different schools and colleges here at UT Austin, from four different departments at Houston Tillotson, also from Texas State, um, as well as from eight different uh, nonprofits um, here in the city of Austin. So it's awesome to see the range of different organizations in terms of nonprofits, 
uh, Progress Texas and Emancipat, for example, uh, the range of um, units. So here E.T. Austin and education and nursing and public affairs and rhetoric and writing. Um, and then from Houston Tillotson in computer science, in history and mathematics. This is a, a wonderful uh, cohort of fellows that we're fortunate to uh, convene here in the uh, faculty fellows program. So we started off with a uh, virtual seminar. So our external speakers, um, our opening speaker was the president of Houston Tulsa University, uh, Colette Pierce Burnett. Um, we had representatives from the city of Austin's um, equity and inclusion program and digital inclusion program. And um, also we had the CEO of the Austin Urban Technology Movement, uh, Michael Ward Jr. And we also had brainstorming sessions on uh, defining social justice informatics, what it is and what it should be. Um, designing AI for social justice, how to make sure that AI can be um, more, uh, more equitable in its application as well as its design um, and how it can be used as a tool for, for achieving social justice. Um, funding for public interest technology projects and our uh, summer research projects. So our re summer research projects focused on the uh, foster care system here in the city of Austin, Texas. Um, the social determinants of health, um, always an important topic, but especially during a global pandemic that has revealed, uh, among other things, uh, the systemic inequities and injustices in our healthcare system and uh, many aspects in our, in our society that have led to um, inequitable and adverse outcomes in the pandemic and that also have been always present and need to be addressed. Um, the social justice informatics data portal and also uh, community engaged research. Um, which in this case involves students uh, from universities such as University of Texas at Austin and Houston Tulsa University working with local nonprofit partners to uh, engage in research. And uh, so this starts with developing guideposts for effective collaboration. We agreed on a shared values and collaboration strategy, scoped our project idea and uh, developed research proposals. And this led to multiple proposals across Houston Tulsa and University of Texas at Austin. So we're sharing our findings through the A Better Tech workshop that NYU is hosting as part of Pit UN here at the convening. Um, we're hosting a research celebration. And also this has led to research collaborations across Houston Tilson and UT Austin. So it's fostering collaborations between our respective universities. It's encouraging Houston Tilson to apply for Pit UN membership. It's created a model for university city nonprofit collaboration. It's helped to define the field of social justice informatics, and it's helped to develop guideposts for social justice informatics research. So our next steps are to submit a joint uh, HTUT grant proposals. Actually, we've already submitted several, so we'll continue uh, um, submitting proposals, but we're also building a broader framework for collaboration between our universities. So we're really excited. We have a group at the vice presidential level of uh, from Houston Tillotson University of Texas at Austin to explore uh, deeper longer term collaborations between our universities. Uh, we're collaborating on educational offerings. We're creating a pipeline, uh, for example, from Houston Tillotson at the undergrad to uh, graduate programs here at UT Austin, such as the master's and PhD programs offered in the iSchool and expanding social justice informatics globally. So thank you very much.